Limone is the Italian word for lemon, and this shore of Lake Garda was once renowned for growing lemons and other citrus fruits. Limone's name, however, is no more than a happy chance since it is said to be much older than the lemon groves and to derive from a Latin word meaning boundary. In fact, this Lake Garda is shared by three Italian regions. Guys, did you know that parts of 2008 James Bond movie, Quantum of Solace, were filmed around Limone, although the shoot was dogged by bad luck and talk of a curse. Some scenes include a car chase along the lakeside road, the Via Gardesani. Ang totoo, magkapatid kami nyan. Alright guys, that's my son. And syempre, ang anak kong camera shy. Katulad ni mami, tumakbo. Na all, na all, na all, sana all, na all, na all. Serious mode naman tayo. Let's enjoy the view. Limone is a popular tourist resort on the shore of Lake Garda in northeast Italy. It lies at the mountainous northern end of Lake Garda. This little town is also a picturesque place to stay. 
and a good base for exploring and enjoying the lake. Although during summer season, it is crowded by tourists. The heart of the old town is the little harbor called Porto Vecchio or Old Port. From here, narrow lanes lined with the tourist shops and plenty of places to eat and drink while admiring the lake view. Visitors here can tour an old lemon grove, the Limonaia del Castel, which is open every day in summer and on Sunday afternoons in winter. Limone Sul Garda is the ideal destination not only for relaxed lovers, but also for those who want to explore the area with excursion or mountain bike tours. The path Sentiero del Sole has the other promenade along the olive trees on the Monte Carone and on the Monte Preal are a must during your stay here. Some trips can be done also by mountain bikes or e-bikes. Today, Limoni Sul Garda is famous for its lemon groves, its exquisite olive oil, and for the longevity of its inhabitants. Hi, Kobe. The town was named Limone San Giovanni in 1863 and acquired its current name Limone Sul Garda in 1904. Let's have a little bit of history of this town. In the year 600 before Christ, the Celtic tribes that inhabited the lakes were conquered by the Romans. After this, the lake's historical development follows that of the rest of northern Italy. From the Longobards to the arrival of Carlo Magno, Charles the Conqueror, the Venetian Republic, the Austro-Hungarian Empire, the Italian Renaissance, the World Wars, up to the birth of the new Italian Republic.
Limone is served by the regular Lake Garda ferries. You can buy day tickets for either the whole lake or just this northern end. This town is also reachable via the main road, which is the Via Gardesana. Bus services connect the towns along this western shore of the lake, with some traveling on to Brescia, which has a budget airport served by Ryanair. They call it Verona Brescia. Other airports which are near to Limone are Milan Bergamo. Further up the hill, you reach the lemon house called Del Castel. This is a lemon house from the 18th century, now open to the public and restored to explain the citron industry that was so important to the history of the town until the end of the 19th century. Once again, thank you for joining me in this another travel diary. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and of course, subscribe to my channel.